So today we're going to open up this Scorpion cooler pad. It's got four fans. Apparently it's meant to be pretty good for gaming laptops. Here we go. There's the USB cable at the back. Just need to uncoil it. Plug it in to the top. There are two USB ports. Just there, two USB ports. And there's some knobs where you can change the speed of the fans. Plug the other end into your computer or laptop. And then once it's plugged in, all you have to do is turn the knobs and you see the blue lights go on. There we go. The fans are spinning. So the, there's four fans. Here there's an option to also turn on the logo, the blue logo. So if you turn the knob, you, you can increase the speed and increase it to make it faster or slower, depending how how you want to cool your laptop. So that's the Scorpion cooler pad. It comes in blue or red LED lights. So now I'm going to test uh, by putting a piece of paper to see how uh, good the fans are. As you can see right now, I've put this piece of paper on and it's not really doing much. You can feel a little bit of uh, wind from the fan, slight breeze, but there's not much but here we go so the problem was the 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 laptop pad needs to be sort of at an angle it needs the ventilation from the uh, bottom to come up the bubble wrap was blocking some of the air so right now this is what you would expect to have some sort of breeze coming from the bottom to the top at the back there's also some little a feet that you can clip out and that would angle the cooling pad so that when you put your laptop there's also some uh, some little clips at the front of the cooling pad so that you can uh, rest your laptop at that angle so there you go so it's, it's not too bad the, the cooler pad cooled a little bit of the laptop and it, it, it helps